So today we have the Reach Road uh, housing power project underway. This is an extension of our existing microgrid distribution system to power up new houses, uh, new loads. The microgrid has existed already for 20 years. We already power the rest of the reservation. And so as new loads are added, um, that takes money. And so far the DOE has been, been here to help support and uh, this project's no exception. Microgrid is a big buzzword in the industry these days. Not very many people actually know what it means to live in the incubator of one for two decades. Owning, operating, managing, maintaining, and expanding that microgrid. And so we have this very unique subject matter expertise that we are offering now through a Section 17, 100% tribally owned corporation to any other tribe who might be able to benefit from it. The state of California through PG&E um, had a lot of rolling blackouts and we would be out of power for um, days to weeks at a time. Having those blackouts, um, it wasn't doing us good. And we we're paying way too much to PG&E in the state of California to um, continue to struggle. And now our cogen currently um, runs in island mode to where we are not dependent on, on PG&E. We haven't had a blackout in over 12 years. Our families are taken care of, our businesses are taken care of, and we've been able to expand on that um, for our future generations. It's been life-changing 